New York, on one end of Madison Square Garden Celebrity Row, Magic Johnson and Odell Beckham Jr. sat next to each other, chatting and laughing it up. On the other end, where the famous sit in the world's most famous arena, Lavar Ball, his wife Tina and sons Liangelo and L.A. Mello were seated a few seats away from Spike Lee. There was enough personality on Celebrity Row to light up Broadway for Lonzo Ball's New York debut. And Ball, the Lakers and Knicks gave everyone in the building their money's worth by going to overtime before Chris Tapps Portenghese lifted the Knicks to a 113-109 victory Tuesday night. Portenghese, settling in more and more as the franchise superstar with Carmelo Anthony gone, put up a new age Patrick Ewing type line with 37 points, 11 rebounds and 5 blocks for the Knicks, 14-13. Portenghese is the first Nick with at least 35 points, 10 rebounds and 5 blocks in a game since Ewing in 1996, but Portenghese did so with 5 three-pointers. Ball wasn't nearly as prolific, though he flirted with a triple-double, finishing with 17 points, 8 rebounds, 6 assists and only 1 turnover. Kentavious Caldwell Pope led six Lakers in double figures with 24 points, but Los Angeles, 10-16, had its two-game winning streak snapped as leading scorer Brandon Ingram cooled off and missed his first 10 shots. He finished by shooting 2-4-12 with five points, seven rebounds and five assists. Also playing in his first game at the Garden, Lakers rookie Kyle Kuzma scored 10 of his 19 points in the fourth quarter, including burying a clutch three-pointer with 24 seconds remaining to send the game to overtime. For being a rookie, he's got a lot of confidence, Lakers coach Luke Walton said. He is not afraid of the moment. The Garden crowd got to see one of Ball's best moments of his rookie season, especially during one head-turning stretch in the third quarter when Ball went toe-to-toe -to -toe with New York's Portenghese and NS Cantor, sending a buzz through the Garden. With the score tied 61-61, Ball threw down an instant highlight one-handed alley OOP dunk from Caldwell Pope in transition. Portenghese responded with a 28-foot three-pointer. Ball then drilled a three of his own. After a canter dunk, Ball drove and scored past Cantor, who came back with another basket before Ball assisted Brooke Lopez for a three. Portenghese then came back with another three, capping the furious two-minute sequence. Johnson, the Lakers team president of basketball operations, stood up from his courtside seat and applauded his rookie point guard. Not bad for a 20-year-old who was visiting New York City for only the second time in his life, the other time being for the NBA draft earlier this year. I think everyone knows when magic is in the building, Ball said of Johnson, who drew a huge ovation when shown on the big screen. Just his presence alone. The other larger-than-life personality on Celebrity Row rooting on the Lakers, Lavar Ball, also was up on his feet loving everything he was seeing. Regardless, he is always going to be turned up, Ball said of his dad. I like his energy.